Hello everyone, I'm Paul Going Blood of the editor of CBN Computer Dealer News, along with uh, my co-worker Ryan Jackson of ITBusiness.ca. Here at the launch of the Surface 2 product from Microsoft in Toronto at the Cool House nightclub. Uh, Brian, uh, what are your initial thoughts and impressions of the Surface 2? Well, I think the Surface is a great form factor for Microsoft and a really strong entry into the hardware market. I reviewed the first Surface and really liked how dynamic it was. You can use it on the subway, you can use it when you get to your desk, plug it into the external monitor, hook up your accessories, and suddenly it's a full functioning laptop computer. So I quite like it, but I, I wish they trimmed down the Surface 2 model a bit more. I mean, the Surface Pro 2 is exactly the same profile, the same weight. Couldn't they make that thing just a bit, you know, sleeker, a bit slimmer? I, I, obviously they could have, but I really don't think it's a big factor, you know. I think it's fine the way it is. And the way they're positioning this product as a basically desktop replacement with a companion tablet product, I think it's going to do uh, wonders for the Surface going forward in the marketplace. Like, I like the fact that there's a keyboard that I can touch type on this and use, you know, my figure for uh, navigating the, uh, the internet or whatever apps uh, they can do. We also they have some great new line of business apps like the one we saw at Denizen uh, from Calgary, I believe. That, yeah, the business uh, analytics one. The business analytics one, which it I think looked is really, really easy. smart. Looked really uh -huh. easy to do. And, you know, if this is going to be positioned as a BYOD product, I think it can work really well. Price point's a little bit too high for my liking at $899. And in fact, the, you can spend as much as $1,800. Exactly. If you want 512 gigabytes of space, exactly. you can buy a service for almost $2,000. It's a lot of money for a tablet. A lot of money for a tablet. What they're selling, though, is manageability and security, which the other tablet devices don't seem to have in spades as this one does. So, and they have a attachable and detachable keyboard. Yeah, these keyboards are great. I mean, they, yeah. especially now they have the power one coming out soon, and so you get an extra charge for your tablet. And also, they've doubled the power capacity on these machines too from the last version, which is which a big is bonus, yeah, of course, right? Huge. Yeah. So uh, I I like it. Yeah, it's a uh, strong entry, good improvement overall, but still, come on, just slim that down, get a, get the hardware fitting into my jacket pocket, and then maybe we'll talk. Maybe for the Surface 3. That's it for me. I'm Paul Dolan-Leto for CDN Computer Dealers. I'm Brian Jackson for IDBusiness.ca.